everyone. Thank you for stopping by my channel today. Today I have a Dollar Tree haul for you. I went into my local Dollar Tree and uh, as I was walking up, I saw a sign outside the door um, and it said they had added the Dollar Tree Plus section to the store. And the Dollar Tree Plus section has items that are $3 and $5. I did go in there and I picked up a few items and I'm gonna show you what I picked up. Uh, and then I did record a little video of the row of the three and five dollar plus items. So I'm gonna insert that at the end of this video so you can see what kind of items are currently in the Dollar Tree. So the first item I wanted to share with you um, that I picked up um, was this storage container and it's three dollars and it has a plus three dollar sticker on it so that's how you know it was more than a dollar 25. so i picked up two of these and i am going to use them in my craft room to put some embellishments in you can uh adjust the different sections depending on your needs and then the other item that i picked up was this mini electric iron and it was, let me find the tag, it was $5 in the plus section. And it is very small. Yeah, I'm not sure how it's gonna work, so we're gonna take it out of the box here in a minute, plug it in, and warm it up, and then we'll test it. Let's take it out of the box and see what it looks like. It's very small, as you can see. Sorry, that's my cat and it has a cord that you plug in there so it's a cute pink color did not know it was going to be pink but there you go we're going to plug this thing in give it a couple minutes while i'm showing you the rest of the items and then we're going to go on to another item that i found and that is this ultra thin portable light pad and let me raise this up and it is 13.1 by 9.2 inches and it has a light and you can trace on it or I think the reason why I got it was I thought it would be good for weeding if I'm doing anything with my Cricut. Okay, it's actually pretty nice looking. And let me see. Comes with a USB charger. The surface is uh, clear. It gives you a nice big area and it's smooth. I have one other plus item. They did have a lot of craft items. They have these uh, little mini diamond fillers for $3. You get nine different colors and they're just like little tiny um, gemstones. So there's the different colors you get. Okay, so I grabbed a piece of fabric that I had in my stash, and this has a pretty good crease in it, if you can see that. So I'm going to iron it and see if it works on this. Well, as you can see, <laughs> there's still a pretty good crease in this fabric. In my opinion of this, I would not waste your money buying this $5 iron. A $5 fail from Dollar Tree. Everything now from this point forward is uh, regular Dollar Tree items that are $1.25. I was um, looking for some storage things for my craft room. Corner Office by Jot Organizer Case, and I got two of them. And these are a good size because they're not too big and they're just big enough where you can put, you know, several things in. Dollar Tree really sells out of these treat bags really quickly. So anytime I happen to see them in colors that I like, I do grab them. Um, I am planning to make a mini album out of this bag. I, I have this in a lighter pink color more um, this shade, but I don't believe I have any in this hot pink color. Um, I do have an Etsy shop, and currently I print out my shipping label uh, just on plain paper through Etsy, and then I tape it on the package. 
but I thought I would try um, getting some shipping labels to see if I can figure out how to get them to print on here. I'm not sure if this will work on an inkjet printer or not. This will definitely be an experiment to see how they work. And I always like to pick up uh, the cosmetic bags when I see the pretty patterns in the um, cosmetic section. It's really pretty pink and orange and I just really like it. And it has like a satiny feel to it. It does open up pretty wide in the bottom. Let me raise my camera up just a little. And it, if you want to set it on a counter, you can, you know, put everything in there and it really will open nicely. These are great little cosmetic bags. I love this rose pattern on here. Now, I normally do not um, get food at the Dollar Tree, but I was headed toward the checkout and I found this bag of birthday cake popcorn by Dippin' Dots. It's caramel corn. It looks like caramel corn and then it has sprinkles on it. But the bag is so cute. I thought it would be a really cute addition to a birthday gift basket or a Easter gift basket even. I did find this in the food snack section. It wasn't in the Easter section. Another brand new, well, brand new to me, Crafter Square item. And it's a bunch of embroider kits. And here is all of them that I got. And I'm gonna show you what they all look like. They all say beginner level on them. And we'll start with this one. It's this little smiley face. And the finish size is 4.7 inches. Comes with directions and tells you what stitch you use and which color thread and how many strands. And the next one is, this is actually a felt kit. Same finish size, 4.7 inches. And you can make these three roses on here. And it includes embroidery fabric, uh, felt pieces, and directions. And then the next two were butterfly. Oh wait, I got three different butterflies. Um, here's the three different butterfly patterns. And then I have three left, and they are uh, bee themed. So yes, I had to get these. So that's everything I picked up. Um, this is probably gonna be my last Dollar Tree for at least another week. So <laughs> thank you very much for stopping by today. And stay tuned, we're gonna take a quick tour down the plus section row in the Dollar Tree.